Hey guys, I'm Lexi. Oh my god, it's a girl! I'm here to show you the solution for the problem that you have pretty much every single day of your life. The moment is here, like, get pumped. So you know all those times that you're, you know, at a, a neighborhood cookout where there's a pig roast, because that's so incredibly common, right? And then the woman at the pig roast just offers you the pig and you just, you can't decline her offer because she's just too sweet. You're just, you're stuck with the pig. You know when you have that problem? Yeah, I'd never had that happen to me before, but it happened. You know, like, what do you do? So the first thing you can do, put the pig in your car. I know it's kind of gross, but just, just let it happen. You gotta do it. Next thing you know. What do you want to Boys are carrying it right now. This is great. You guys didn't notice there was a pig in the back seat! <laughs> Call up your friends, say, hey, we're gonna come over to your house. Invite them for some Slurpees, cause like 7-Eleven Slurpees are just like the bomb diggity dog. Have them walk, walk down to your car, open the door, and... What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> is that real? <laughs> what the fuck? Messed up in the head. Hey, hey, ew. You guys, ew. That's so gross. You don't even want Slurpees, do you? <laughs> If they are a little bit rowdy, as as is understandable, wait for everything to calm down, make them feel better, and like actually take them out for slurpees. Now the second thing you can do, <laughs> this one causes ruckus though. Take the pig from your car and drop it off on a random per- I wouldn't recommend random persons because I could be trespassing. Actually, it was an expensive pig, so like maybe they'd be happy for their new, their new options for pork and bacon and such. I still wouldn't risk it. But you can drop it off on one of your good friend's doorsteps. What step do we want to put it on? Lex and I are in the car. Pig is still in the back seat. Yeah. Get the pig. I can't name the pig because it'll become emotionally attached to it and can't drop it off anywhere. And we're going to drop it off one of the driveways. And we mean it in all good fun. <laughs> the destination we've chosen is Kaylee's house. The only way she's going to know it's us is if she watches this video. And we're going to place the pig promptly on we her have doorstep. to be really quiet. Yeah, I'm going to park like four houses up. It's time to say goodbye to this, um, this kid. We're here, so i got to get off the phone because we got to be quiet, you know. Do this! <laughs> All right, so we're starting. Lexi. I don't think I can hold it. I don't think I Lexi, can pick it up. Lexi, you're gonna have to. It's still the shape of a pig. Oh, I can't do Lexi, that. you can do this. I don't think, no, I don't think you realize. Okay, let me man up. Oh, man. Oh. <laughs> Just imagine as if it's your child. <gasps> it's not like a child. It is. It's just a child. It looks just like you. This is a funny sight. It's really heavy. It's like it doesn't let me. I'm gonna take a picture of my phone. Seriously, though, no, it's heavy. Oh, what is that? Something's crawling. I think it's a leg. Okay, one more, one more. It was blurry. Shelby, seriously, I can't. It's Wait, okay, let me take one more without the flash. Shall we ring the doorbell? Let's run. Here's the pig. And here's the door. Shelby's gonna ring the doorbell. And we're gonna run. It's go time. We saw a lot of our pig on popular social networking sites. I just wanted to give you some creative solutions for um, all the times that you are left with a pig. I'm just kidding, I know this never happens to anyone, but it was a funny event that I thought it would be worth sharing, so if you like my videos or you like me, think I'm like kinda cool, I'll put my link to my channel in the description box. My channel is BeautyRush315 and I'm from 
like the beauty community of YouTube. I guess that's like how I'd be more well known for. Follow me on Twitter. My Twitter is one and only Lexi. I don't normally care about the numbers on Twitter, but I'm so close to 10,000 followers and this is, I just want that K by my followers. I'm like only 50 away and I know I can do it and I would love the help of you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy your day and happy Sunday. Bye. You said it best, brother. Oh my gosh, it's a female. <laughs> Too much, too much. It's an all guy collab. I have to. I'm the first female to ever be, I feel like, honored. I just figured that I would feature myself on that YT life because I'm all about that, that YT life. Keep checking my channel. Bye. I'm Gnoshi5th time. <laughs> I don't even know my own username. I know, they're like, I'm bored. I don't want to watch this girl. I don't know who she is.